Clifford, my big red dog. Clifford needed Emily, so she chose him for her own. And her love made Clifford grow so big that the Howards had to leave their home. Clifford's the best friend anyone could know. He's the greatest dog ever. I really think so. Clifford's so loyal. Clifford. He's there when you call. I love Clifford, the big red dog. So they packed up a family car and the Howards left the city. They moved to Birdwell Island and their many new friends. There to greet Clifford and Emily. Clifford's so much fun, he's a friend to us all. I love Clifford, the big red dog. You cannot move in freeze tag, no matter what. That's the rule. Oops. Gotcha! Whoa! What do you think you're doing? Can't you even say you're sorry? He can't talk because we're playing freeze tag, Mac. Wanna play? With T-Bone? Well, that wouldn't be fair. I mean, me with my speed against the slowest dog on the island. <gasps> hey, that's not nice. <laughs> Are you kidding? Not only is T-Bone fast, he can jump so high and he's really, really strong. Hmm. Yeah, right. Whatever. T-Bone is a pretty fast runner. He's strong, too. Oh, really? You think he could outrun, outjump, outstrong me? With both paws behind his back. Really? Then how about a little contest? Me against T-Bone. Winner take all. Okay. Winner take all. All what? If I lose, I give T-Bone my gorgeous collar. If he loses, I take his collar. Deal. Deal. This'll be great, huh, T-Bone? He won't talk, because you didn't unfreeze him, Cleo. You know T-Bone, he never breaks the rules. <laughs> okay, T-Bone, I officially unfreeze you. Why'd you say I'd race him, Cleo? What? I don't want to race Mac, especially for my brand new collar. Why didn't you tell me? Because you cannot move in freeze tag no matter what. Those are the rules. Oh, yeah. Well, don't worry. You're going to do great in this race. Are you sure? Have I ever steered you wrong? Lots of times. Huh? Well, not this time. Because Clifford and I are going to help you get ready for this race. Okay, T-Bone. The race will start at the dunes. Go through town. Then you'll jump over the Bleakman's Garden. Run all the way to the beach. Pull a wagon across the sand. Then make a final dash across the, the finish, finish line. line. <laughs> wow! Wow! What are we waiting for? Let's start training. Faster, T-Bone. That's the way. You're looking strong. Go, T-Bone. Just say to yourself, I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. A little higher. Get down! 
down. Remember, T-Bone, I can do it. I can do it. Okay, now you try. Ready, T-Bone? Just remember... You, you can, can do, do it! it! Okay, you ready for the race, T-Bone? Yep, I really think I can do it. Sure you can. So, T-Bone, ready to back out? No thanks, I'm ready to race. Okay, on your mark... Good luck, Mac. Uh, yeah, right. Get set. Go! Go. Yeah. Wahoo! Go, T-Bone! I never see another dog again. Woo, 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 woo. Woo, woo. It will be too soon. See who's the winner here. Come on, you can't do it. Kiss your collar goodbye. I can do it. I can do it. What a race. Unbelievable. I won. I won. Here he comes. He 
didn't win. I did. Did you see me? Did you see how fast I was going? Sure did. You almost won. Mac almost didn't stand a chance. I mean, I wasn't sure I could do it, but I really almost won. You were awesome, T. Hooray for T! T-Bone's the best! I don't get it. What are you so happy about? I'm the one who won, you know. You're right, Mac. It was a good race, but you won. Go ahead, Mac. You won my collar fair and square. Yeah. Uh, fair and square. <sighs> oh, keep it. I don't even like it. It's okay, Mac. You ran a fair race and I lost. You earned it. No, I... I didn't earn it. I cheated, okay? I didn't win it fair and square. I could have, but I didn't. So I want you to keep your collar, okay? Next time, I'll really beat ya! Poor Mac. He feels really awful because he cheated. Yeah, but you didn't. You were awesome, T-Bone. Thanks. I did my best. You really tried. And that's what made it a really great race. Story, don't you? <laughs> I thought so. He's your favorite. Today's story is Speckle and the Old Wagon. One day when Speckle and his friends were playing, Speckle saw something behind a tree. They gathered sponges and buckets of soapy water and went to work. Now it was time to paint the wagon. Ravi wanted to paint it purple, but Luna wanted pea green. Reba's favorite color was blue, and Darnell liked bright red. Speckle wanted everyone to be happy. So together they painted it all the colors of the rainbow. Then off they went down the grassy hill in their wonderful rainbow wagon. The end. That was a great story. Isn't reading fun? <laughs> Tummy trouble. Okay, Clifford, sit. Good boy. He sure loves his Bowser bites, doesn't he? He could eat them all day. But today we're doing tricks for treats, Clifford. Let's try down. <laughs> Good boy. Good morning, Emily. Good morning, Mrs. Bleakman. Want to see Clifford do a trick? Oh, no. No, thank you, dear. He's a very cool dog, you know. Yes, well, he's a very big dog anyway. I just wanted to let you know that Mr. B and I are painting our fence today. That's right, and we don't want a repeat of last year's fence painting incident, now do we? Careful, Mr. Bleakman. 
You stay far away from that fence today, okay, boy? Whoop! She couldn't have gotten a guinea pig, oh no. Okay, Clifford. Let's see. How about uh roll over? Emily! Charlie, we gotta go! We're gonna be late for soccer. Coming, Mom! Gotta go, Clifford. See you later. Oh no! I didn't give Clifford his treat. You'll have to do it later, honey. We're late. Uh-uh. I'll give you your treat when I get home, Clifford! You think he's okay, Cleo? I don't know. He hasn't moved since we got here. Maybe we should get Emily. Emily's gone, remember? We saw her leave with Charlie. <gasps> Emily's gone? But she was supposed to give me a Bowser bite when I finished my trick. No problem, big guy. I'll get it. Think you should? You did your trick, right? Yeah. So you get a treat. Emily'd give it to you herself if she were here. That's true. If it'd make you feel better, T-Bone and I'll share it with you. Yeah! Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Here's some for T-Bone. Some for me. And some for you. There. Now everyone is happy. Wait, you guys didn't do any special trick. Emily was giving me treats for doing tricks today. Okay. T-Bone, do a special trick. <laughs> now that was special. Here, T. Good throw, Cleo. It was good, wasn't it? A throw that good definitely deserves a treat. It was pretty great, but you're going to get sick eating all those Bowser bites. <laughs> Thanks for worrying about me, Clifford. That's very special of you. Special enough for a treat. Hey, watch this. <laughs> Oh, oh, I'm dizzy. Good one, T-Bone. And another great toss from me. Hey, watch me. That's great, big guy. Watch out for the fence, Clifford. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh-oh. This cannot be good. I'm okay. Hmm? And I didn't even hurt the fence. This calls for another round of Bowser Bites. Gee, Clifford, maybe it's a little too early to celebrate. Huh? You got something on your back. What? Where? What is it? <gasps> oh, no. Don't worry. I know what to do. Really? Have I ever steered you wrong? Okay, guys, here comes the water. Is it working? Well... It will. In the meantime... I want another Bowser bite. <laughs> well, 
That's the end of this barrel. They're all gone? Don't worry. We still got three more barrels full. Uh, is my back clean yet? Uh, not quite. I think you're going to need to scrub it a little. Y you mean like this? Exactly! And well worth a Bowser bite, too! This is a great kind of bath! You get clean and dirty at the same time! A special bath deserves a special treat! <laughs> My tummy kinda hurts. Yeah, mine kind of does, too. You're probably just hungry. Here, have some more Bowser Bites. Uh. Oh, I'm so full. Me, too. <laughs> Me, three. <sighs> hey, Cleo, is my back still dirty? Can't tell. Too much mud. Look at me, I'm clean! Emily will be so happy. Uh, I'm not so sure about that. Huh? We gotta clean this up before Emily gets home. Bleakman, Emily Elizabeth, <gasps> the fence, hurry. <laughs> Get away from that fence, you mammoth sized mutt. Is something wrong, Mr. Bleakman? That big red furball of yours is near my fence. Hmm, must be doing something wrong. Oh, you know. Oh, come on, Horace. Let's just go back in and finish your nap. He just can't believe what a good dog you've been, huh, Clifford? Woof! Sorry I left in such a hurry this morning, Clifford. I owe you a treat. I brought you a doggy bag full of goodies from the soccer picnic. And don't worry about Cleo and T-Bone. There's plenty for them, too. <sighs> Is something wrong? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like they've had enough goodies for today. Clifford, did you eat all those Bowser Bites? <clears throat> and Cleo and T-Bone helped? <clears throat> I can't believe it! I know Bowser Bites <laughs> taste good, but you guys ate way too many. Ugh. Well, I guess maybe you've learned your lesson about too many <laughs> treats the hard way. <laughs> and next time, I'll be sure to put those treats away somewhere you can't reach them. <laughs> hey, everybody makes mistakes sometimes. Even the best dog in the whole wide world, my Clifford. <laughs> wow, T-Bone, your sandcastle looks great! It sure does, T. Thanks, I did the whole thing all by myself. Clifford and I know that it's always important to be thoughtful of other people's feelings and ideas. That's why Clifford's big idea for today is respect. You know what would make it even better, though? A great big flag! No, I think it's great just the way it is. There. Now it needs a big wall. No, it doesn't. Cleo, this is T-Bone's castle. 
Before you change it, you should find out if he wants you to. I'm sorry. Next time I'll remember to ask first. Sometimes our friends have thoughts and feelings that are different from ours. When we take the time to find out about those differences, it shows how much we care. That's why Clifford's big idea for today is respect. No matter what, that's the rule. Oops. Gotcha! <laughs> Whoa! Freeze! <laughs> what do you think you're doing? Can't you even say, you're sorry? He can't talk, cause we're playing freeze tag, Mac. Wanna play? <laughs> with T-Bone? Well, that wouldn't be fair. I mean, me with my speed, against the slowest dog on the island. <gasps> hey, that's not nice. <laughs> Are you kidding? Not only is T-Bone fast, he can jump so high, and he's really, really strong. Hmm. Yeah, right, whatever. T-Bone is a pretty fast runner. He's strong, too. Oh, really? You think he could outrun, outjump, outstrong me? With both paws behind his back. Really? Then how about a little contest? Me against T-Bone. Winner take all. Okay. Winner take all. All what? If I lose, I give T-Bone my gorgeous collar. If he loses, I take his collar. Deal. Deal. This'll be great, huh, T-Bone? He won't talk, because you didn't unfreeze him, Cleo. You know T-Bone, he never breaks the rules. <laughs> okay, T-Bone, I officially unfreeze you. Why'd you say I'd race him, Cleo? What? I don't want to race Mac, especially for my brand new collar. Why didn't you tell me? Because you cannot move in freeze tag no matter what. Those are the rules. Oh, yeah. Well, don't worry. You're going to do great in this race. Are you sure? Have I ever steered you wrong? Lots of times. Huh? 
Well, not this time. Because Clifford and I are going to help you get ready for this race. Okay, T-Bone. The race will start at the dunes. Go through town. Then you'll jump over the Bleakman's Garden, run all the way to the beach, pull a wagon across the sand. Then make a final dash across the, the finish, finish line. line. <laughs> wow! Wow! What are we waiting for? Let's start training. Faster, T-Bone. That's the way. You're looking strong. Go, T-Bone. Just say to yourself, I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. A little higher. Remember, T-Bone, I can do it! I can do it! <laughs> okay, now you try. Ready, T-Bone? Just remember... You, you can, can do, do it. it! Okay, you ready for the race, T-Bone? Yep, I really think I can do it. Sure you can. So, T-Bone, ready to back out? No thanks, I'm ready to race. Okay, on your mark. Good luck, Mac. Uh, yeah, right. Get set. Go! Go. Yeah. I can do it! 